What's up, guys? Go check out Wrestle Ops. Uh, yes, uh, if you go back and look at some of Ricochet's older stuff before he went to WWE, this dude could do shit that was unexpected. Amazing. Off the wall, fucking awesome. And yes, he might do that for a few weeks, maybe even a month or two in AEW, but then he's just going to be another guy in the company and probably not get any real TV time. I'm sorry, that's what's going to happen. When you got guys like Daniel Bryan, Will Ospreay, uh, and all these New Japan Pro wrestlers that are coming to the company that are fucking phenomenal wrestlers, uh, eventually Ricochet is just not going to fit in anymore. And that's what's going to happen. But, like I said, go check out Wrestle Ops on Twitter. We'll read what Will Ospreay had to say. It says, Will Ospreay feels that Ricochet has been downplayed for so long and wants him to remind the world that he's one of the best to ever do it, aimed impending arrival in AEW. So here is what the sacked words were from Will Ospreay. I honestly feel like he's been downplayed for so bloody long that people have forgotten the freaking athlete that he is. So if it is true, and he, if he is coming to AEW, which he is, he has signed with AEW, guys. I am calling you out to remind everybody who the fuck you are. Because without a shadow of a doubt, we're the man, Dragon Gate, PWG, the Indies, around the world. No one could effing touch you. I'm calling you out, bro. I'm saying, remind the world that you are one of the best who have ever done this. I believe it, and if I believe it, you got to believe it yourself now, boss. So, that's a big thing coming from Will Ospreay, because Will Ospreay is considered to be one of the best wrestlers ever, which is kind of crazy to even think of, being he's never been in the WWE. So most people are like, well, if you've never been in the WWE, you can't be the best wrestler ever. That's just dumb. That's just dumb. But uh, there's probably hundreds of great wrestlers that never make it even on any of the big brands. They're just indie wrestlers that fight in their hometown. Like, there's probably hundreds of wrestlers better than WWE, AEW, TNA, Major League Wrestling, New Japan Pro Wrestling. There's probably hundreds of wrestlers that have never been in any of those companies that are just phenomenal. So, we'll have to see how it plays out. Like, I've seen some of Ricochet's stuff before WWE, and he was freaking awesome. But you got to realize he is older now, so can he go like he used to go? And then you got to look at guys like Daniel Bryan that uh, had a certain way they could wrestle in WWE that he's wrestling totally different now in AEW. So we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. Maybe Ricochet will... Uh, Make me a believer, and maybe he will be one of the biggest stars in AEW. I don't think that's going to happen, but possibly it could. Like, comment, and share, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.